guys welcome back to my channel and as usual welcome back to my home it's super good to have you here guys today so in case you are new here my name is sue Carey. i am a stay at home mom of one lovely boy a four year old boy called dylan and uh today i wanted to show you what he eats in a day so i wanted to show you what he eats for breakfast for midday snack for lunch after uh mid afternoon snack and for supper and he is very 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 picky and he is not a good feeder but i am trying to get uh to devise a way to like uh, get him to feed nicely so let me just show you what he already have prepared for him uh breakfast and i wanted to show you what he eats for breakfast and as we progress during the day i am going to show you what he eats as the day progress until evening so kindly consider um, subscribing uh share me out as much as you can if you are in a position to like my content so that youtube gets to recommend my videos and of course leave uh me a a comment uh, in the comment section so that we can get to engage and I can get to hear from you we can share our ideas of course I'd also love to know like what your kids eat in a day I can I can really like to know because uh, here it's all about sharing you learn from me and I learn from you so without like uh, wasting so much time let's get to see what he is going to have for breakfast today is uh for breakfast uh, this is what i've prepared for him he's going to have cake a cake and tea normally for breakfast he will have whatever it is that we are having so if it is sweet potatoes he must have those sweet potatoes if it is like eggs he will have those eggs so there is when it comes to breakfast there is nothing specific or special about it he will have whatever we are having for the day so here it, this is the cake and this is a uh, tea and this is what he's going to have for breakfast it's around uh he really wakes up very early during the weekend so it's about 7 30 and after, at around 10 that's where i'm going to get like uh to prepare something else for him as we wait for lunch time so yeah so if you have a kid like um who doesn't like uh who is not a heavy feeder you can go in with something light uh, like for breakfast and all that don't um like push it just allow them to eat what they can handle something light if it is like the sweet potatoes and they don't like the sweet potatoes you can just give him a bit of it don't like push it a lot so, so that he can uh gradually get to like the meal as for midday snack he's going to have potato crisps urban bites if you've never tried try this they are really really nice and kids really uh love this so he really loves the urban bites and i'm going to give him a uh, yogurt fresher yogurt he loves caramel flavor so uh i usually buy uh, um many and keep them so that he can have um have them for his snack so if your toddler is not a heavy feeder like dylan is you can come in with uh yogurt in between the meals and yogurt is very good because it uh it helps in giving the toddlers appetite and it's also uh good in um in uh in the stomach it's really good with the stomach so he will have this for the midday snack and then uh later on i'm going to like prepare his lunch for him and then i am going to show you so guys now i want to prepare for him uh lunch it's lunch time and i want to cook for him noodles they come like this in a pack so i buy several for him and uh, to make this meal uh, interesting and sweet, these are the ingredients that I'm going to use. Onion, a bit of garlic, tomatoes and carrots in uh, the noodles. So the key here is just to make something sweet that he will enjoy to eat. That's the secret that I have with 
my picky son i have to make something uh, sweet yet healthy in the process so that he can be able he can agree to it to eat so this is what i'm just about to cook and uh, yeah let's cook together The goal here is to, if you, for example, if you have a picky child, it's just to make something very sweet. So I'm going to go in with a bit of spices, soy sauce over here, uh, cumin, and uh, a bit of rosemary. So the secret is just to make the, the stew, I mean the food sweet, so that they can take, so that they can uh, like eat. So that is my onion and garlic over there i want to put the carrot and the tomato so guys that's how it is looking right now so also remember that kids love bright things so when they see that the food is colorful they will also eat so if your child is picky i cook something that uh, will catch their eye so let me put a bit of soy i'm just going to put a bit not much just a bit uh, I'm going to go with my cumin just a bit guys because it's a kid and then a pinch of a pinch of rosemary so that's how we are rolling oh. <clears throat> his lunch is ready that is the outcome and uh, you can see looks really really yummy it is super super yummy and super easy to make and uh, very good for picky kids so this is something that you can quickly prepare at home if you have one of those picky kids dylan here's your lunch <laughs> mm. be careful be careful Yummy. So he's there enjoying his lunch. He really loves noodles. So if you want him to eat, that is what he really likes. So guys, if okay with the noodles, you can put beans, you can put vegetables. That's another good thing with noodles. So you can uh, balance the lunch or the dinner for him. So for me. Is it yummy? Be careful. Yummy? Ah, yeah. Okay. Enjoy your lunch. So it's about 4 for 30 o'clock in the afternoon and this is what I've prepared for him. Peanuts, cake, yogurt that he had left uh, for, uh, in the morning and then some fruit. So I'm just here trying to balance uh, give him uh, sweet things but also healthy things so that's another secret for healthy picky kids of course he doesn't love fruits a lot but one fruit that he loves is uh oranges and that's what i never lack in my home yeah oranges so guys now it's dinner time and this is what he's going to have for dinner he's going to have ugali uh, which is on the side and then he's going to have this is pork with a little bit of soup on it so this completes our day today i hope you have enjoyed this um little vlog that i had and i hope that you've gotten a tip or two from me so from me uh until uh my next video it's a goodbye and don't forget to subscribe to share me out as much as you can like Leave me a comment and I will appreciate it so much. I love you guys. Bye.